let's look at how to change Caddy's configuration while it's running. To start, we'll open a file server on port 8080 with file browsing enabled. I'll post this configuration and try it out. Okay, it works. But now we want to use a different port and disable file browsing. Here's the new configuration. You can see I've changed the port number and removed the browse parameter. When we post it like before, the changes take effect immediately with zero downtime. I'll refresh and you can see that the old listener is closed and the new one has no file listing when a directory is requested. But we can still access individual files on the server just like we wanted. That's all there is to it. Config changes in Caddy 2 are easy, lightweight, and graceful, even on Windows.